Today in class, we're going to go over test review, class survey, and major changes. But no more class survey today. Today, I'm going to be telling you what to do. Today in class, we're going to have some major changes. When I was looking at your last exam two test scores, they were really pathetic. And I think there needs to be a lot of change so we can get those scores up so I can be a better teacher. First, we're going to be doing all PowerPoint. And the reason for all PowerPoint is because your guys' test scores were between 20% and 30%. And that is just pathetic. What were you guys doing out there? Come on. Secondly, we're going to be doing a study guide after the exam. Because honestly, I really don't want you knowing what's on the exam, and I want you to be, I want you to be reading through your notes, because that's why I'm writing on the board. <laughs> Thirdly, we're going to be having no student feedback, because honestly, we're not going to be doing a democratic style in the game anymore. It's going to be autocratic because I'm going to tell you what to do and I'm the teacher and I want to look better for the department. So with these changes, I, I've been looking at the syllabus and I've been thinking it's not as concrete as I wanted it to be. You guys' test scores were pathetic, but I was thinking a happy teacher equals a happy life. So you make my life easier, I'll make your life easier. Maybe less homework. Let's see how that works out. How do I feel about Professor Howe's new plan on change? I think it's a load of baloney to be honest. I mean, for first, first off, the PowerPoint going to that, I mean, that's, that's not going to help me out in any way. I like his interactive style of kind of writing on the board, explaining stuff to us. It really helps me to like understand it, like get it down in detail. And then also moving towards reviews after the exam, I mean, that doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Having that before the test, being able to write things down, really see it and review it over and over. That's helped me a lot on the quizzes and the exams. Um, and then again, not having any sort of student feedback, that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Uh, in class, being able to go over questions from the test that you didn't understand, that was really helpful. Um, but I do see what Professor Howe's doing here. In the readings, we talked about Lewin's model. Seems to me like he's starting from the first stage of unfreezing. Uh, you got him coming in with this big announcement, talking about this radical change he's going to implement, um, and then him communicating some convincing reasons to this change, um, creating motivation for us. He showed this big graph, like his evidence to us, showing like where we're at, how bad our grades were, and then he, um, to compel the change, he basically told us, you know, I want this to be a mutually beneficial relationship. I want it to benefit me, you know, give me some higher status in the department, um, and then also benefit you guys, benefit your grades. Um, so basically, if we are able to work hard the rest of the semester, it'll just get easier on us. Um, that's what he proposed. I'm not sure if I like it, but I guess we'll just have to deal with it and find out. So class, with the changes that I've already described to you, I kind of wanted to go into more depth of why these changes should be happening or be put in place. So first, with all PowerPoint, I kind of just wanted to uh, stifle all, crea or all creativity in the class. I really don't want you guys branching out. I want you guys to stick to what I'm teaching in the class, not really going in the book about what, what is supposed to be taught in this class. Secondly, a study guide after the exam. Honestly, I think if you guys are just going over my notes, that should be enough. Study guides really don't help you that much. And a study guide after the exam will just show you what you guys missed out on. Thirdly, no student feedback. Uh, I mean, do you really want to hear what one of your peers is saying? Like, what if they're saying something wrong, honestly? Like, I've heard a lot of, I've heard a lot of remarks before, and honestly, I don't know if they're the most correct remarks. So I just want to teach you what is the correct answer. Thirdly, lots more reading. I mean, come on. Reading always helps. What, like, what's not the benefit of reading? It'll, it'll just benefit you. It'll, uh, it'll grow your understanding of the classroom. And thirdly, the syllabus changes that I've given to you guys, um, they're really going to help you guys so you guys can get a better understanding of the class. And the reasons for these, like the benefits, I mean, it'll help you guys later on in life. Uh, it'll help me get a better prestige in our department. And I mean, the better I look, the better you guys are going to do in the class. So that means less homework and more time for you guys to do what you want. So what do I think about Professor Howe's change? Well, first off, he mentioned um, that he's going to just do PowerPoints, which I mean, would be nice because I would like to be able to read his handwriting at some point during the semester. Also, the study guide after the exam, I can see where he's coming from because I don't really use the study guide to prep for the exam, so I guess if you were to do it afterwards, it'd be okay, I'd be okay with that. Um, no student feedback. 
I think he was uh, very valid when he talked about having the students' feedback not being accurate. And you know, if, if anyone knows best, it's Professor Howe. Um, I mean, more reading. He had mentioned giving us more reading, and honestly, it would only benefit me. I mean, would I like to read three chapters a night? Probably not. But, you know, if it gets me an A in the end and it makes him happy, well, I guess my life's just going to be easier. So I'll agree with that kind of change. And the syllabus, I mean, it's kind of whatever he wants to do. He runs the show. He's the main man. So I will definitely comply with those changes if he, if that's what he wants to do, if that's the direction he wants to go with the class. First, he kind of came in and provided us with um, some new information and direction. And then he described some new procedures of how he's gonna run the class and some bookkeeping things. And then he highlighted the benefits to us. So at the end of um, proposing his change, he just said that, you know, if it benefits me, it'll benefit you. And honestly, if I get an A in the class, like that's what I'm here to do. So we'll see how this change goes. And so far I'm for it. Congratulations class. I'm so proud of how you guys did on this past exam. You guys, no one got lower than a 95%. The head of the department even came up to me and congratulated me on how well I've been teaching my students. I mean, with the changes we're having that I've made so far um, through the semester, we'll see how they go. We'll stick to them and kind of see if anything needs to be changed, but I don't think so. I think they're great changes. Uh, also, you guys have been doing so well and you guys have been making me look so good as a professor that we're not gonna have the quiz on Wednesday and you guys are gonna get credit for it. So let's follow through with these changes and see how they play out the rest of the semester. Okay, so initially, you know, I wasn't too big on the changes, you know. Me personally, I think I'm the greatest student that ever lived. So I didn't feel that I needed to change. But you know, when he, when he started explaining, you know, why we might need to change, and I thought about the changes that we are gonna make, I was like, okay, I'll give it a chance. Then to see my new grade, which, you know, of course I made 100. You know, I did well on the last one. I mean, it was the best of the worst, but still. So, you know, <clears throat> he supported the change. He told us how, you know, evidently he's like a rock star now with the head of the department coming in and telling him how well he's doing. And then, you know, he even offered us, you know, a little reward. We, the quiz we just get credit for, you know. I wasn't gonna study anyway. So, you know. <clears throat> This, this change thing, you know, he really solidified these changes. He really refroze them, if you want to say that. So, I'm all for the changes. And going forward, I support it. I'll co-sign it.